at um, a property up in Heathcote Junction, which is in the hill of Mount Disappointment State Forest, and that was taken by the, the in the Black Sad Day bushfires, and I lost um, um, all my workshop and 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 my house was seriously damaged in the in the um, the fires as well. It took quite a while to recover from that, um, and so this project is important for me too because it's sort of part of the the healing process as well, and the, and you know and gathering of people who have been through the same sort of thing. We started on the 14th of February um, 2009 and it's now November 2013 so this is the, the last stage of assembly. Um, after that we polish her up and um, out she goes and she gets installed um, hopefully by the end of this year. This is the last night of the main structural welding so this is um, putting the main last main two branches on the tree. A couple of nights ago we connected the, the top branch that you see here um, onto the main trunk and now we're positioning the other two branches onto the trunk. They weigh about 200 kilos each so they're quite kind of tricky to move around. The leaves are very special, yeah. Um, about half of these leaves, maybe about one and a half thousand of these leaves have been donated by blacksmiths around the world. So we have about or over 20 countries represented here. Um, countries like um, the Ukraine, um, England, Ireland, Scotland, Italy, um, America, Canada, Belarus, Uzbekistan, you know, amazing places, um, France as well. Um, so lots, lots from overseas and about half made by Australian black suits and many of those are sponsored leaves, so people who wanted to help the project and, and you know, help, help us make the tree sponsored leaves and um, had a message or a name stamped in those leaves. The project started, we've got um, a lot of fine leaves that require TIG welding and oxy welding to attach the leaves onto the branches and that's very fine and small and we like to do it um, as neat as possible to minimise any grinding. When you're welding the leaves on it's quite tricky, first of all you've got to um, choose where they go so, so getting the layout and the shape and the, the form of the tree is quite, is quite difficult, it's almost a, a job in itself is just the layout of, of the leaves. I've checked every single leaf on this tree. That was my, my job, was is the, the final checking. Um, and I've probably welded maybe a thousand of the leaves at a guess, maybe, I don't know. <laughs> Tonight we've got some, some guys coming in who are involved with the heavy welding, so they're using a big, big machine and um, are doing the big, heavy, strong um, structural welds. But to see it all come together is, is is unbelievable. Next weekend we, um, we put it on display to the public in Whittlesea and after that, maybe in a couple more weeks, we take it to Strathewan and it's installed.